Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Using Acrobat Pro DC, you can create PDF portfolios. A PDF portfolio is a customizable collection of files. A portfolio can contain many different types of files, not just PDF documents. While many users might choose to simply merge outside documents into a single standard PDF file, a PDF portfolio offers several advantages by keeping individual files separate. Files can be added to or removed from a PDF portfolio easily. Files do not need to be converted into PDF format to add them to a portfolio. When working with a PDF portfolio, you can edit individual documents without changing the other files within the portfolio. Additionally, Acrobat Pro makes it easy to work with files within a portfolio. Non-PDF files can be edited in their native applications from within a portfolio and changes are automatically saved to the portfolio. The component files of a PDF portfolio can be sorted by customizable categories and a search feature lets you search an entire portfolio including non-PDF documents. To create a PDF portfolio, select File, Create, PDF Portfolio from the menu bar. Doing this opens the Create PDF Portfolio dialog box. Next, use the Add Files drop-down to add content to the portfolio. You can add individual files or entire folders to the portfolio. You can also add a scanned document, a web page, or content copied to your computer's clipboard. As you add items to the portfolio, the Create PDF Portfolio dialog box displays the content as thumbnail images. You can use the slider bar in the bottom left corner of the dialog box to reduce or enlarge the size of the thumbnails. By default, PDFs will appear in the portfolio in the order by which they were added to the Create PDF Portfolio dialog box. If you want the files to appear in a specific order within a portfolio, you must rearrange them in the dialog box prior to creating the portfolio. You can rearrange files by clicking and dragging them within the Create PDF Portfolio dialog box. When you have arranged all of the content you want in the portfolio, click the Create button. Acrobat creates the portfolio and displays it in the main document window. Just above the document window, you will notice the Go to Previous File and Go to the Next File buttons. You can use these buttons to navigate through the files in the portfolio. To the right of the navigational buttons, you will see an Open Document link. You can click the Open Document link to open the currently selected file in the portfolio in a new tab. When you create a PDF portfolio, Acrobat also displays thumbnails of the files within the portfolio pane at the left side of the screen. The top portion of the portfolio pane includes a small toolbar. You can use the four buttons in the toolbar to add additional content to the portfolio, create a folder for the portfolio, extract files from the portfolio, or delete content from the portfolio. At that point, choose File, Save Portfolio from the menu bar to save the new PDF portfolio. The initial view after creating a PDF portfolio file is the layout view. We will discuss the views of a PDF portfolio file in the next lesson. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.